Right, Stuart, it's now time to bring out one of the big guns and look at the 21-year-old. Now, we've moved up a gear because here we're 100% sherry cask matured. You look at that colour. That is deep, 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 uh, deep, deep copper coming in there. I mean, it's a remarkable colour. And the way it sticks to the glass as well. The way it reacts with the glass, the, the length of time it takes to run down, everything about that is just telling me I'm going to enjoy this whisky. We've got lovely red tinges, or certainly, as you say, copper. And this is because we're using a lot of European oak casks here. Now, these are quite rare casks in the industry. We have to get them custom made for us. Very time consuming process. We then get them seasoned with sherry not to add sherry flavour, but to get the wood in the right style for our whisky. And then we leave the whisky for at least 21 years. It's long term stuff, isn't it? it is. So what are we getting in the nose here, John? We've got, uh, the first thing I get is uh, those lovely dried fruit aromas. There's sotanas, there's, 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 there's even some, some hazelnuts in there. Just delightful, very intense. You've got a lot of colour, you've got a lot of richness. But the Glengoyne character, the apples, are still there. You've still got this lovely freshness just at the heart of the dram, mixing with the complexity that you get from the sherry casks. By no means is this overly matured. And now I'm drinking the dried fruits are very much there. There's a little bit of there's spiciness, there's warmth there. There's, there's, there's cinnamon, there's, there's spicy oak. And, and again, that all just comes around to give it body and to give it depth. You're not getting any burn. It's just sitting there, it's almost velvety and coating the mouth. And there's just so many appealing flavours coming through there. The fruitiness is the first thing to hit, but then the spices just warm the side of the mouth. And it really is quite wonderful. I'm glad to see those flavours continue into the finish and it stays with you for ages. Of course, this is a long-term project because as well as the 21 years in the cask at Glengoyne, before that, we're six years preparing the cask. We've got to dry the oak in the sun in Spain. We've got to season it with the Oloroso sherry for, for, for almost three years. And you add all that together, this is actually 27 years in the making. There's no shortcuts. And you've got to take the time. You've got to spend the money and you've got to invest the time to get this kind of whiskey. For me, this is my... This is my ultimate after dinner dram. I want to, I'm almost inviting a cold Scottish evening just for the excuse of putting the fire on and sitting back in the armchair with this thing in my hands. Fantastic whiskey. John, the Glengoyne 21 year old. Here's to it. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs>